so baby update today, and we got a doctor's appointment. What are they gonna do, babe? Uh, probably just hear the heartbeat, and I really don't know. I don't remember what they do at this stage. Oh, okay. It's been a long time. <laughs> By the way, we're looking for a name, so if you comment, share, and like this, maybe we'll pick your baby name, huh? No basic name, please. No basic names. We got like a handful of names that are pretty out there, like Joaquin Phoenix, huh? I honestly do like the name Joaquin. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just playing about that. But I'm not. <laughs> pick a name, comment the name, like the video, share the video, and that's what you'll get. You'll get to name our baby the internet is gonna name our baby. And then I'm gonna show this whole shit live, man. I'm gonna take the camera into Kristen's vagina. Ah! <laughs> and then you guys are gonna see the baby born, man. So what did you think, man? I think that he's a fossil and I'm looking for a new doctor. Yeah. The guy doesn't even have fitted pants. How are you going to be a doctor? His hair wasn't even brushed. It looked like he rolled out of bed. He did. He didn't even look showered. Yeah. New doctor all the way. Oh, my God. You know what's crazy, though, is that he came recommended, right? A lot of people say he did. Yeah, he had good reviews, which I don't, don't care about those anymore. It took him forever to find the heartbeat. He was like, in my bone. Like, you're not going to find the heartbeat there, okay? You're fucking stabbing me in the bone. Move over. He had pants like a cholo. Baggy ass shirt. Like, if you're a doctor, you need... You need shit tailored, bro. Like, <laughs> I know you. I know you got money. You know, get some good clothes, some good shoes. You know, he's old as fuck. If anyone can recommend a Lodi OB, let me know. <laughs> How foggy it is, man. I mean, you can't see the stoplight until you're there. On positive note. The heartbeat was at 152, which means that it's going to be a boy, right? According to the old wives' tales, if it's below what? 165. If it's below 165, it's a boy. And that girls have faster heart rates and boys have slower heart rates. So at least we got that. Still six months now. So we just got back from Denny's and we're gonna chill. And then we gotta pick up Callie in a little bit, huh, bro? Yes. So. I can't wait until my kid can just like drive herself home. <laughs> mm -hmm. She can just drive and we don't gotta pick nobody up. Short. She didn't even pick up the new kid. What? So we gotta pick up Callie right now and I wanted to end the vlog with this, okay? 
The importance of a baby name. When I chose Callie's name, I was thinking that I wanted the whole world to be about Callie, you know? And Callie came from California, and I wanted to name her California at first, but the name was too big, and I thought eventually it would just be too ugly of a long name, you know? So I took the shortened version of it, and I named her Callie, C-A-L-I. And everything around her in California is has Cali, you know, and it makes it in her perspective that the world is about her. It boosts her self-esteem and her ego a little bit, and it makes it special for her. And even the other day, Cali told me that they were talking about California or something in her class, and a kid even said, Cali is the queen of California because her name is Cali. So it just kind of proved to me that I was right in naming my kid Callie, you know, and it turned out to be the correct move and it boosts her self-esteem that the world around her is hers, you know. So the next kid, uh, I'm going to come up with something like that. Uh, I would like for you guys to throw your ideas. We, Like I said, I got a handful of names but we still aren't sure on what to do what name to pick and if you guys can do that and comment a name idea that would be cool and who knows maybe we'll pick yours and you'll be a special person for naming our kid peace